Hi, my name's Keith Rail, and I'm one of the CISO instructors for EC Council. Today we're broadcasting from Casa Rodania, which is a winery here in Albuquerque, New Mexico. Uh, it's a beautiful property, very rustic looking. If you get a chance and you're in Albuquerque, stop by uh, this beautiful property and take a look at this winery. Anyways, a little bit about myself and my background. I've been in security for probably 20, 22 years now, in the security industry specifically. Before that, I was in the military. I spent 21 years, uh, eight of which were in the Air Force. I was a nuclear weapons technician. Um, and then I moved over to the Army, went to flight school, flew helicopters. I was a test pilot and I had leadership positions, uh, ran platoons and companies and things, um, and uh, got out after 21 years. And this is where uh, I started my current career in the security industry. So when I got out, I went into consulting and uh, worked with a very, very large company. Uh, a lot of the interesting places uh, that I've been to include like the World Bank, Corning, manufacturing up in New York, Honda USA, um, NASA JPL. After that, I had a variety of, of different roles and responsibilities. I've been a CISO, I've been a director of security, I've implemented various parts of security programs and assisted people in doing it. Um, I've been in auditing, uh, so pretty much every aspect of security uh, that you can imagine from a governance instruction and program level. I enjoy astronomy, I like to play the piano and, and things like that, and, but one of them is winemaking. I really enjoy making wine at home. In fact, I teach people how to do it. Um, I like to share what I've made. Uh, I've also patented a home uh, brew filtration system. It's just this little kind of a, a gizmo that people use to filter their wines and beers and, and kombucha and things like that. And uh, like I say, I patented it and I sell it up on the internet. It's kind of a side thing. So here we are in the barrel room of the vineyard and there's lots of activity out there collecting the grapes, smashing them down, getting the juice, fermentation with yeast and da da da. We do all these things. But honestly, when it comes down to the character and the body of the wine and what it's actually going to become, this is where the, the uh, action quietly happens. There are two primary types of kegs that are used in the world today with winemaking. Um, the first one is out of American oak, and the second one is out of French oak. Um, and so Chardonnays go through a malolactic fermentation and they're put in the kegs, and that takes uh, malic acid into a lactic acid, which is smooth and buttery anyways, and then it imparts this vanilla type of, uh, or this vanilla hint in the wine, if you will. We do it with reds, whites, everything else. But anyway, so that's the two primary things, letting it age and get better, and imparting the, the, the kegs, or the, this, this oaks, character into the wine. So anyways, that kind of wraps up the winery talk. Uh, we look forward to having you in that course. I look forward to seeing you in the course. And uh, thank you for paying attention and your time and everything else. Hope you learned something and enjoyed this. Again, I'll see you in Domain 1. Thanks.